Here is a solution for question 8. I hope you appreciate that first we gave set of questions and now we are giving you solutions, right? So it gave you an opportunity to first find out your own solutions and then look into our suggestions. Well, there can be more than one way of doing all these questions. In fact, there are many ways to do any of these problems. So, you know, the way which we are doing may help you at times. The points A, B, C, D and E are selected at random in the plane. Show that AB plus AC plus AD equals to EB plus EC plus ED plus 3 times AE. So let's take points, right? So point A. So let's take A here. B, C, D, E. So I prefer to take them in order. It's B, C, D and E. Let us say, right? So we have A, B. A, B is, let's say this is A, B. Let me write this here. A, B. And that is C for us. Then we have D and then we have E for us, right? So what we are saying is AB plus AC plus AD. So we are considering these three. Their sum is equal to sum from E, right? So from E to B. So, so that, that is what we are E to B. So from E we are connecting all other points. E to B. Then E to C, right? and from E to D and three times A to E. So A to E also. This is also there, right? So these are our different connections which we are going to deal with. So let's start with the left side. So left side for us in this expression is AB plus AC plus AD. Now since we want in terms of E, so let's say A, B, how can we write in terms of E? So A, B can be written as A, E plus E, B, right? So we'll write this as A, E plus E, B. Similarly, A, C. A, C can be written as A, E plus E, C, right? So A, C will be written as A, E plus E, C. And AD can be written as AE plus ED, right? ED. Now, as you can see from here, we've got three AEs, right? And the other terms which we wanted. So it's kind of simple. So we'll just write three times AE plus this, which are not AEs, right? These are the three terms. EB plus EC plus ED, right? And that's what we wanted, hence proof, which is our right side, correct? So we have proved left side is equal to right side, and that's how we're going to prove it. Thank you.